Guys, it's day two of Trump's presidency. I'm already fucking exhausted. This is, I'm ready for it to be over. What's up? It's Lisa Curry. I'm here at the Women's March in New York City. It's uh, January 21st, 2017, the day after the inauguration of President Trump. Holy f what a nightmare. There's 673 marches worldwide. There's over 600,000 marching in D.C. today. Uh, men, women, children, people in cheese hats, all kinds of people out here in the streets. There's actually even a pile of in the corner that looks just like Donald Trump. It is uncanny. We've been uh, taking interviews with it all day, and it is more coherent than our president. It's pretty incredible to see this huge group of people, and everyone is peaceful. People have been talking about riots or violence, and none of that has happened. Trust me, if it was, I would be participating because I am fucking pissed. But uh, nothing bad has gone down. Everybody seems safe and happy. Uh, there, we visited the Lady Parts Justice booth in the UN building earlier today. That was a lot of fun. We got to talk to Liz Winstead and some of the Lady Parts Justice people. One of our big missions is that we want to be intersectional in our work. Um, how do we talk about reproductive rights if we don't talk about whether or not, if you have a kid, it has a world to grow up in that's clean, air that's right. clean, water that's clean. Um, uh, free of gun violence. And so what we wanted to do was gather all of us together and then have folks who maybe are first time marchers as we've heard so much about yeah. people attending. It gives them an opportunity to see the global reach that activists have been really talking about for a really long time. So yeah. it gives them a chance to hook up with um, different organizations and also to see what leadership looks like and maybe eventually even volunteer with leadership that doesn't look like them. Yeah. <laughs> we are both in New York stands for voices of community activists and leaders. And we are out here today to represent, because yes. I'm not going to be quiet. Woo. Like I no, said, no. woman power, y'all, woman, woman power. Woman power, everybody. Woo. Woman power. It's 4 p.m. We've been marching since 9 a.m. I have not seen a single news crew. This is the closest thing to a news crew I've seen, so I am taking it into my own hands and reporting for NBC. Live. And Fifth Avenue, Trump Tower is just around the corner. Cops are kind of clearing people out of the streets. I just heard there's been over 200,000 people here today. That's pretty exciting. That's more people than the inauguration. I think we need to start burning things. I mean, truly. I kind of was hoping to come around the corner and see a fire at Trump Tower, uh, but unfortunately that hasn't happened. I feel good about today. I feel like we accomplished probably nothing because Trump doesn't give a f that we're out here. This is how we do it now.